Hey there, Motor One readers, or I guess in this case, viewers. Happy holidays! So in between all of our year-end reviews, lists, articles, etc., we decided to take some time and do something that everybody can get behind. Unboxing videos! Yeah. Woo! And Jeff, tell us what we're unboxing. These are Candy Lab's new candy cars. And they're like the size of a Hot Wheels or Matchbox, but they're made of wood. So they're handmade. They cost about nine fifty on the website, nine dollars and fifty cents. But they're pretty cool. They're like our favorite toys of twenty eighteen, right? No, these are definitely we think the best automotive car themed, whatever you want to call it, gift of the year. What'd you call them earlier? Wood wheels. Wood wheels. Wood wheels. We're down with that. Um, they're very wooden. Let's get right to it and unbox these bad boys. Yeah. All right. This is the first one. This is Sherwith with a W because. It's adorable. They only have six right now, but I'm sure they're gonna come out with more. Um, this one's pretty great. It's a little cop car. It's got a little tiny light on top. It doesn't light up, but it looks adorable. Um, and they roll really well. So like, you know how some cheapo die casts, they're like, not great to actually play with? Yeah. These are cool. And you would actually play with these? You would just like, oh, yeah. display them on your desk? I mean, as an adult. <laughs> You would probably just put them on your desk and play with them sometimes, but I think they're good for kids too, right? They're sturdy. That's the other thing. They're not candy. They are not candy. You can't Don't eat, them. eat these. Full That's disclaimer. Right, okay. What's next? Do the next one. You want me to go? Yeah. Do you know yeah. what this one's called? Red Racer. Red number Racer. Five. But it's like peach. Wasn't Speed Racer number five? Yeah, I think so. Maybe we, not. We defer to you on questions like that. that I let's say that. yes for them. This one's cool. I think it looks like an old AMC. It's definitely not quite a wagon. It's a little a Marlin. It's that a was fastback. It's a fastback? It's the Marlin that it looks back. like. Something. What yeah. about Fox Body Mustang? Are we getting a little bit of that? Maybe, yeah. so That's all Marlin. It's all art, Greg. We can yeah. call it whatever we want to call it. But that's the racer one. For me, that's Look, actually... It's got, it's got little red wheels, even. I've got my favorite, the Homer Simpson car. I really don't know what it's called because I didn't go to the website like Jeff did, but it looks like Homer Simpson's I car. I think it's I called it. Pink Sedan. Pink Sedan. I'm pretty sure that's what Homer Simpson's car is called I too. Think so. What did the pink? Did the Pink Panther drive? Like the cartoon character? Yeah. <laughs> I think he did. I think he drove something like that. So could that be this, or is this literally only Homer Simpson? It looks more Homer like Simpson. Homer Simpson's car. Deal. Fine. I like it. Wait, what kind of car does this look like though? Like in real life, uh, something boxy, like an old Chrysler. I'm saying like Ford Thunderbird a little bit. Yeah. Maybe. I don't see Thunderbird, but I'm seeing Homer Simpson's car. <laughs> Which is what? We don't even know. I think it's a Plymouth, they said one time. But you're right, it's missing the dent. This is like, so this is Blue Racer. It's almost like a Volvo. I mean, it kind of looks like Red Racer, but it's blue and yellow. It's really not Swedish, we just... No, it's not Swedish, it just... Looks like an old Volvo race car or something. And then, uh, they could have gotten a little more creative with the names. Blue Racer, it's kind of obvious. So you're saying Red Blue Racer. ones to name the next round? Yeah, what would yeah. you name this instead? Did you hear that, Candy Lab? I would name it... Boxy Bugle. We'll I work on the names. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> the New York City Special, The Taxi. Is it called The Taxi or is it a more fun name? I think it's the called taxi. The Taxi. This one for me isn't quite as cool as the cop car, but I can appreciate that they're doing like public service vehicles, if you will. I think that's a bad take. It's much cooler than the cop car. That's how? What about this is cooler than the cop car? It has a light on it. Yeah, Have you ever think... seen the Jimmy Fallon movie Taxi with Queen Latifah? That's Queen Latifah and Jimmy Fallon were never in a cop car. Maybe they should have been. Yeah, yeah. Maybe they should have been. We got Jeff's favorite here. That's my favorite. This one's called... I want to be a mom or a dad <laughs> tomorrow. This is the most station wagony of all of them. It's a woody. It's a little woody. It's cool. Made out of wood. Yeah. Ironic. Yeah. I think it's the color. It's got a little stripe. Things, right? Well, yeah, it's teal. It's called teal wagon, officially. That's your favorite out of all. This is my favorite. I mean, because I'm an auto journalist, and it's a wagon, and that it's a cliche that I have to follow. Um, so yeah, it's pretty cool. It's the only wagon, too, out of all of them. As far as body style goes, which one's the coolest out of all of them? These ones are definitely all sedans. This one is, oh, these are both fastback. Oh, these are a little different, though, right? Can yeah. you tell or no? Yeah, it is a little, a little different. Bit. This one's a little more squared off. Yeah, and then you get the wagon. Favorite to least favorite. I'll let you go at it. Well, you know what my favorite is, the wagon. I yeah. guess I won't fight Mine you on that. You made this. a pretty strong case for the wagon. Right. I mean, it's the only wagon. So this is your favorite, Greg? Yeah. 
And then my favorite is a cop car by far. So Why? Because it's cool. It has this thingy on I top. Mean, yeah. It has a siren. And it kind of looks like the cop car in the Incredibles movie. Like, yeah, those, like, that is true. The old timey throwback. I don't yeah. know. That's the one I would have for sure. 950, that's a great stocking stuffer as well. Oh, yeah. For anybody. It's better than the calendar I got. So. <laughs> what calendar did you get? It's like a dog calendar. My mom just always gets me calendars, so it's like I'd take one of these over that any day of the week. We could actually probably make a hilarious calendar with this, and we did a calendar shoot, like one for each month. Well, there's only six, so it'd be half your calendar. Good point. So. <laughs> we need to have six more, and then we yeah. can make a full calendar, but for now, the half calendar is coming out. Yeah. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, everybody. We're excited to bring you some great stuff next year in 2019.